Hello. Three more off my crafting bucket list. Okay, we're gonna make tear trays. We're going to make gnomes and they're adorable woodland gnomes. And we're gonna make flower pots. All items are from the Dollar Tree. Some odd items that, that uh, you might not think of using. It's gonna be a fun one today. Eight, hey, and there's a chance for you to win $120 worth of Dollar Tree slash Dollar Tree slash gift card items. So you have to stay right till the end. Make sure you don't miss my mystery question. Let's get lit. In this first DIY, I'm making tear trays. I'm taking alcohol ink and 91% isopropylen alcohol. It has to be 91%. I... I'm adding a lot of alcohol because I am going to light this on fire. Yes, we're going to have a Canadian bonfire. Canadian bonfire where you bring your dragon torch, you bring your 91% alcohol, and you light that puppy up. So much fun. The alcohol, the fire evaporates the alcohol and all the beautiful alcohol ink colors all melt together and you never know what you're going to get. I'm participating in the mystery box challenge. Today in the mystery challenge, the mystery box challenge, you could win up to $110 worth of hard to find Dollar Tree items and a gift card. To be eligible to win the prize, you have to hop to all the channels. You have to watch them. You have to answer. They're gonna ask you a question. Answer all the questions in the comments below on every single channel. And then you have a chance to win. If you're meeting me for the first time today, I'm Sandy. Sandy Lumber Mill DIY, and I do lots of woodworking, wood burning, art, crafts, DIYs. I love it all. Say hi to the camera. Oh, the baby girl. Oh, oh, the baby girl. This is my house hound, Ella. Leonep at DIY Beauty on Purpose is the person that sent me this box. And this is the treasure she sent me. She. Uh... <laughs> Some of you might not know, I'm in Ontario, Canada, and we are in lockdown. So when we go to the dollar store, we can only buy essentials like food, <laughs> health and beauty, and some kitchen stuff. So 
I grabbed that crap <laughs> and I stuck it in a box and I mailed it. So if you want to check out who I mailed it to and what crap I mailed to her, hop on over to the next video. A person picks out seven to eight items from the Dollar Tree and ships it to you and you have to craft with it. Today, <laughs> my craft crap, yeah, I said it, came from Lee and Epp. DIY beauty on purpose. Lee and Epp, I don't know if she hooked me up or screwed me, I don't know. But she gave me a traffic cone, really? Really, a traffic cone, an orange traffic cone? Yeah, and she gave me S hooks. OMG, I, the struggle bus was real, but it turned out really good in the end. And you need to check out Leonep and Sammy. They are amazing. They went head to head this weekend. They're in the Heidi Sambo's Creative Challenge. They went head to head. There's only two left and it's those two. Heidi announces the winner. I'll leave the links below. It's, it's gonna be a fun one. Today's mystery question is, what inspires you when you're creating? I really, my, my main inspiration is Dougal. He is my father-in-law. He passed away four years ago and that boy got it done. He was, he was an artist. He carved and wood burn and he gave his art all over Bruce County. He really got it done and that's my struggle is to complete it like just get it done done is better than perfect so my main inspiration and every time I'm creating every time I'm crafting Dougal is right there beside me giving me inspiration
you like some of my crafts or you want to see more, smash my subscribe button, ring my bell, and let's chat. You, me, down below. The algorithm loves that. And they might show me to more people. <laughs> Don't forget to uh, hop on over to the next channel and see who it is and what crap I sent her. Oh, too funny. I'm so glad I didn't get that box.